Hey, what's up guys? It's Durf. Man, we are back. We got some uh, Ether Revolt. I've had a uh, sealed case of Ether Revolt for a while uh, since release. And I uh, figured we'd go lottery hunting with these things. Um, you know, these really haven't gained too much value uh, since they were released. You can still find them online for, uh, you know, around 40 bucks. So I uh, figured crack some open and, uh, <clears throat> you know, see if we can hit a lottery card inside the uh, case I have. So let's take a look. Um, pretty close to War of the Spark release coming up here. So excited for that. Uh, should have uh, some booster boxes coming for you guys. So no, I've been uh, pretty lax on getting videos out, but um, you know, if you guys have been following my last videos, uh, I've been I'm in a, a new place up in Williamsburg, Virginia, and sold my. I'm selling my house in Virginia Beach, so I had a lot of transition <clears throat> from that. And um, you know, hey, don't steal. Uh, a lot of transition from that. It's just been uh, pretty hectic. So um, you know, with work and trying to um, get everything transitioned over. So, anyways, uh, top ten coolest cards. Let's take a look in this one. So we got Tezzeret. Ajani, uh, Shram, we got Mechanized Production, Fatal Push, of course. Uh, we've got the Indomitable Creativity, Rich Cars Expertise, the Ether Harvest, Ether Sphere Harvester, uh, Servo Schematic, and Maverick Thopterist, uh, the top 10. So, no Paradox Engine <laughs> on top in here. I think that's the most expensive card now. Um, fatal push still worth a couple bucks even after rotation so uh, looking to find maybe those but uh, you know walking ballista still very good card uh, I think the uh, metallic mimic is still up there so <clears throat> I don't know maybe I can uh, mimic some of my uh, old pulls with <laughs> when I got a foil what I get I got a uh, engineer explosives, a walking ballista foil, and a fatal push foil, all from the same box. So, uh, you know, probably probably not going to get that kind of luck in this because you're only looking at ten packs. But anyhow, uh, if you guys haven't seen one of these bundles before, uh, which I'm sure you have, get the little useless box here. But at least it's you know something versus just packaging. Uh, so you can put stuff in there. You got your player's guide. You got your uh, please don't steal uh, electronic device, electronic uh, activation device here that, you know, if you go through a <clears throat> one of those wand looking things at Walmart or something uh, and you haven't paid for it, it will go off. So you got a little poster inside, a little thing that wraps around it, and you got the box here. That's always good value. So those are nice too. <laughs> As you can see, there's I've all these old school ones here. So we've got... Like Ice Age, I think that one was Planar Chaos. Uh, it's original Ravnica over here. Then we got, I think that's uh, Avison, yeah, Avison Restored over this one. And then um, way over here on the side, we got Soren with uh, Dark Ascension. So, and I think some Dominaria ones here on the corners. <clears throat> so, boxes are good for, you know, holding cards and all that good stuff. <clears throat> so, sorry, kind of getting over coal here. All right, so we got. Land pack, of course, uh, Ether Revolt did not have basic lands, but uh, they do give you the Kaladesh block lands there. All right, we got 10 packs of awesomeness here. And if you guys are ever looking at the card codes on the back, the little codes, uh, the bundles do not have two lines of code. Uh, the uh, bundles and fat packs don't, but the, uh, the booster boxes do if they're made in America. I don't know, no <clears throat> real rhyme or reason, I guess, but uh, there's our little die. We got a white one, so that's cool. All right, well, let's, uh, oh, and you get a quick reference card, so you get that. All right, well, if we do future ones of this, uh, if I don't hit an invention in this one, we'll crack open some more, but uh, hey, wish me luck. Here we go, so <clears throat> let's crack in here, see what we can get. All right, so we'll go through all the commons. We haven't seen Ether Revolt for a while, so go quick here. Chaser, Shipwreck, Mori, Caught in the Brights. That one's a cool one. I like the art on that Your little guy. I'm a gremlin. Uh, Silk Weaver Elite, Fourth Bridge Prowler, Prey Upon, Aegis 
automaton. Now, just remember um, <clears throat> when you're opening these packs, uh, usually if you get nine for this set, if you get nine commons, uh, you have a foil at the end. So let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, so we're not going to expect a foil at the end. But we have an Outland Boar, a Scrapper Champion, <clears throat> Sly Requisitioner with the just beautiful art there. Very cool. And the rare is a Quick Smith Spy, so nothing. All right. <clears throat> then we got a Plains and a Servo. So nothing yet. <laughs> no good hits in that one. All right, pack number two. Got the... Dispersal Technician. Look at Vidalkin. Stop, you cannot pass me. Uh, Audacious Infiltrator? Am I saying that right? Audacious? Man, my English my English be good. Shock. Okay, nice stable card. Renegades, Gateway. Lifecraft Cavalry. Iron Tread Crusher. Look at that guy. Look at those big wheels. Negate. It's like... I'm, I'm negating you with my chest energy. My chest mana. Uh, consulate turret. This one's interesting. So it deals two damage to target player with some energy there. All right. Ether stream leopard. Leopard. Welder automaton. <clears throat> First uncommon skyship plunderer. Another sly requisitioner. Ridge scale tusker and the rare. We got a life crafters. Bestiary. This one's pretty cool. It lets you uh, scry, and when you cast a creature spell, you can pay a green. If you do, you draw a card. So that, one's, that one was always handy. <clears throat> Got a green and an energy reserve. <clears throat> so, yep, not worth really anything anymore, but, you know, always a handy card. Uh, Chandra's Revolution. Metallic Rebuke. Uh, I think that one, that one would be really good uh, with the War of the Spark coming out, and Tezzeret Planeswalker that's coming out. Uh, Audacious Infiltrator. Fourth Bridge Prowler again. Prey Upon. Look at that. All the same order. Ether Poisoner. Implement of Impro uh, Improvement. Ether Stream Leopard. Prize Fighter Construct. Bastion Inventor. All right. Another Outland Boar. Let's guess. Uh, what's the next one going to be? Is it the Slide Requisitioner? Nope. Gremlin Infestation. Pacification Array. Nice to be see uh, Fatal Push. That'd be cool. And Rishkar's Expertise. All right. So we got one out of the top 10. Not that, you know, these are terrific or anything, but um, I think this one sees a little bit of, <clears throat> might see some play in um, you know, Modern or um, Commander. So uh, Swamp and an Advertisement card. All right, we got a wrangle, wrangle and them gremlins, bastion enforcer, conviction, fen hauler, universal solvent, sweatworks brawler, iron shred crusher, foundry assembler, the gate again. All right, first uncommon, so we might have a foil on this one. I wasn't counting, but feels like it's. Uh, we got more cards back here. Daredevil dragster, Gonti's machinations, consulate dreadnought, and the rare. Pia's Revolution, and I do think we have a foil, so let's see. Uncommon Treasure Keeper! Alright. Oh, well, that's cool. Uh, this one, so when Treasure Keeper dies, reveal cards from the top of your library until you reveal a non-land card with converted mana cost three or less. They cast that card without paying its mana cost, but all reveal cards not cast this way at the bottom of your library. Random order. Alright, cool. First foil. Island and a servo. So, not bad, not bad. <clears throat> Not an invention, but, you know, whatever. Leaving the dust. Decommission. Frontline Rebel. Silk Weaver Elite. Defiant Salvager. Prey Upon. Destructive Tampering. Filigree Crawler. Augmenting Automaton. Implement of Combustion. First Uncommon. Life Crafter's Gift. We got a Reverse Engineer. Blurry. Feldar Guardian, and the rare... Oh, there we go! Nice! Paradox Engine! 
Ding, 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 ding. All right. Well, that's that's worth its bo that's worth the box price there. Nice. All right. So whenever you cast a spell, untap all non-land permanents you control. And we got a planes and energy reserve. Cool. All right. Paradox engine. All right. Well, that one that one wins the day. Well, let's see if we can uh, can we spice it up even more and get a invention out of here. Ooh, that'd be sweet. All right, Frontline Rebel, Metallic Rebuke, Caught in the Brights, Silk Weaver Elite, Defiant Salvager, Prey Upon, a bunch of those, jeez. Augmenting Automaton, Ether Inspector, Implement of Examination, Aegis Automaton. Oh, there we go, Winding Constrictor, Hidden Stockpile, and Enraged Giant for the uncommons and the rare is a consulate crackdown and no no foil that enters the battlefield exile all artifacts your opponent controls until consulate crackdown leaves the battlefield I'm surprised i didn't see hmm, any more play oh it's all artifacts okay just the artifacts just the facts just the facts man just the facts all right moving on Precise Strike, Interland Drake, Alley Evasion, Ether Herder, Fen Hauler, Silk Weaver Elite, Aegis Automaton again. We got a ton of those. We got a playset, Countless Gears, Renegade, Implement of Combustion. Oop, first uncommon. So I think we got a foil. Daredevil Dragster again. Ironclad Revolutionary, Enraged Giant, the rare. Ooh, Mythic Etherwind Basker. All right, two mythic box, awesome, and a common silk weaver elite. Not bad. Either one basker, not not really doing much. Uh, you know, just ridiculous casting costs of seven there. Three green and four colorless. All right, we got a shock. Taking a custody, gear per osprey, uh, unbridled growth, night market aeronaut. Ether Holler, Herder, Ether Herder, 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 uh, Reservoir Walker, Filigree Crawler, Ice Over, Implement of Combustion, got a Trophy Mage, first uncommon, Deft Dismissal, Monstrous Onslaught, and Heroic Intervention, nice, man, yeah, that's, uh, should be one of the better, uh, rares still, Swamp and Ethereum cell. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not sure what the prices are on these anymore. I really haven't kept up with them. Maybe I'll between the next video and uh, <laughs> this one and the next video, I'll look up the prices and see which ones are doing the best. But Metallic Rebuke, Dawn Feather Eagle, uh, Embril Gear Smasher, Fourth Bridge Prowler, Ether Herder, Night Market Aeronaut, Universal Solvent, Bastion Inventor. Mobile Garrison, Laugh New Sailback, First Uncommon, got a Shielded Ether Thief, Pima Ether Seer, Maverick Thopterist, and War of Invention. All right, I think both of those, these two were on the uh, top 10 coolest cards that they said. All right, Island and Energy Reserve. All right, last pack of this bundle. Um, we got five more to go <laughs> to try to hit an invention. Might open them all. We'll see. I don't know. Might run out of uh, interest. But uh, let's see what we get. Maybe we can get a fatal push in this pack. Shipwreck Mori. Caught in the Brights. Precise Strike. Fen Hauler. Silk Weaver Elite. Fourth Bridge Prowler. Night Market Guard. Destructive Tampering. Foundry Assembler. Negate. First Uncommon. Oh, get the Aetherborn. Used to be really good in standard. Malfist Revolutionary. Illusionist Stratagem and the rare is a disallow. Man, we got got some good pulls out of this bundle. Mountain and a gremlin. So no invention. Womp womp womp. But good grief. Look at these rares. Got uh, eight rares and two mythics. So disallow, heroic intervention, war of invention. I mean heroic intervention, war of invention, ether basker, um, Paradox Engine, I'd say all those are, and Rishkar's Expertise, like that's really not bad. So, dang, pretty darn good. All right, well, 
appreciate you guys checking out the video. Um, hopefully you guys are having a great day and looking forward to War of the Spark. Well, uh, I'm going to open some more bundles. So uh, join me next time as I keep looking for an invention out of this sealed box uh, or sealed case of Ether Revolt bundles. Chandra, are you pointing towards the invention? Is it that way? I think I'll have to find out. All right, guys. Have a good one. Talk to you later. Bye.